You know, I think people are excited about IoT now because we've gone beyond the promise or the vision of IoT, and we're now into real deployments. And we have a, really a, a technology environment that's created a perfect confluence of capabilities to enable the vision to come to life. Perfect examples are uh, communication speeds. We've seen bandwidth decrease 40 times in its price over the last decade. We've seen uh, computing power increase 60x over the same period. And the availability and cost of sensors has also uh, exploded over that last uh, period as well. So these combined with the power of the cloud and the adoption of customers to embrace these technologies into their business models to transform is what's making people really excited because the vision is becoming a reality. Intel's super excited to attend the inaugural IoT Solutions World Congress uh, for simply the reason that if it's half as good as the Mobile World Congress has been, it's going to be the premier event uh, for IoT globally. It's all about personal connection, engaging with customers, engaging with partners to collaborate. If there's one thing we've learned about IoT, no one company can do it alone. It really requires a system of systems and a network of networks to make it happen. And IoT Solutions World Congress should be the perfect environment to make that happen. Intel's vision for IoT is actually the same vision we have for the whole company, which is we believe if something computes and connects, it does so better with Intel. So not only are we focused on the devices themselves, but how those devices connect to the edge of the network, which also has compute and connect capabilities from Intel, and then all the way back into the data center. And connecting all of that is a fabric of software, everything from edge management software and operating systems, all the way through a security layer uh, that goes end to end. We're looking forward to engaging with the Industrial Internet Consortium at the IoT Solutions World Forum. We believe, uh, such as many of the consortiums we're engaged in, that this one is um, really important for driving open architectures and standards to make it easy and repeatable for customers to deploy IoT solutions very quickly and cost affordably. You know, we really provide solutions to any industry where there's a strong value proposition for the adoption of IoT solutions. So historically, that's been early adopter industries such as retail, but we're seeing a tremendous amount of growth in areas like healthcare, where we have the opportunity to transform not only the economics of healthcare delivery, but also real health outcomes for patients. We're seeing it in the manufacturing sector, where IoT solutions are driving higher levels of availability of manufacturing lines and increasing quality of output. We're seeing it in the industrial and energy category, where we're getting higher throughput and output of uh, energy uh, production and greater efficiency of energy management and distribution. Even in smart buildings, we're seeing real estate owners take advantage of IoT technologies to deliver a better service to the people that are coming into that building, but also dramatically reducing their utility costs. So wherever there's an opportunity to drive transformation and a strong business case, as well as hopefully a real societal outcome, that's where we're seeing a focus. Well, I'll tell you what we're not gonna talk about. We're not gonna talk about how big IoT is, because I think we've exhausted that topic to death over the last couple of years, and the hype is uh, greater than it's ever been. Instead, what I'd like to talk about is real solutions that are making a difference for not only industries and the companies that are deploying them, but solutions that are making an impact to everyone on the planet in our daily lives. I like to call it IoT for life. I can't tell you about every success story today because then there'd be no reason for you to come visit us in Barcelona at the keynote. But what I will tell you is we've published a lot of case studies as well as reference designs and architectures on our website. So if you wanna take a look, you can get a preview of some of the things we'll be talking about in Barcelona. And I promise I will surprise you with even more uh, case studies to show you what's possible in IoT.